All right, here we go. New tricks for Caroline. Caroline's my brother in thumbnails. She makes the thumbnails for SLS Street League. Yep. Back nose one? It's because it's your first time drinking Monster. You're just different. It's true. Oh my god! One more! One more! You're there! It's crazy, you and me have the same warm-up line. Right out the gate? I mean, obviously it's a line. Stop. Say that again? <laughs> Dude, what did you just confess to me? I sadly don't know how to do a kickflip. There's no way. Can you kickflip so high? I feel like you can put it anywhere you want. Right now? Yeah. It's, oh, I'm not going to say anything. Yeah, you got it. There's a roll blade here and he waxed the crap out of everything and he waxed. It's so scary to grind this thing. Yeah, you can easily do that. What? I feel like you do know how. It's just your. I've done kick looks. I've, I've done like kick looks in front legs. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it was only oh absolutely it. <laughs> Wait, you weren't trying it already? You are just playing? Like, I'm talking about like actually. Yeah, come in. So, right when Devin got here, he died on this quarter pipe because it was super waxed up. Oh, you had. <laughs> you had. And then I slipped out real hard on a 5 out of 15 because I didn't know. And I literally said, like, really loud. Like, I was just like, who the fuck waxed my quarter pipe? And I look over and he's, like, staring at me and he goes, <laughs> it, it's super uncomfortable, but you have the right kick flips for it. Like, when I flip front grind, I flick at it. You're flipping, catching, and setting it where you want. You have the correct kick flip for this trick. I don't. And I can do this trick, so that's how I know you can too. Kick flip low C. Worst ledge in the world. Is that it? I don't know. There we go. That was it. I heard that grind. Yeah, you're way above the ledge. Try uh, 5 0. Hell no. <laughs> Good call. Hell. Like, why does that work for a shot? Know, right? like, so he's recovering from food poisoning, and I'm coming off of an injury. Also, a uh, 102 fever. Jumper's knee, so it's a good day for skating, and it's really windy. Two bags of saline in me at the hospital. Oh, they pumped you up yesterday. Yeah, literally two bags and this vein. They went to go stick an IV in it, and it just fucking exploded. Because that's how strong you are. Or like, what the hell just happened? They're like, oh, that's normal. And then I started, your vein exploded or the my, IV bag? My vein, and then I started like I was already dehydrated, and then They're losing all that. They're like, oh, he's dizzy. He's dizzy. Get him in. And then they pumped one bag of saline and they're like, we should probably get him too. Hey, food poisoning is the worst experience. We should do a challenge where you intentionally get food poisoning and you have to do the straight eight. Oh my god. This straight eight would be hard enough just by itself. <laughs> right now. Straight eight right now? Oh my god. Oh, you got it. I know the first four are going to be great. Oh! oh the worst kick we've ever done. Hold on. Okay. Yup. Okay. Yeah, you better switch it up. Oh. Damn it! <laughs> you almost made four. I was I was counting on five because I know kick flip, fakey flip, fakey heel, heel flip, and not a heel are gonna go. There's switch heel. Okay, fakey heel. 
<laughs> uh, manual cone challenge. I would say that that was first try, but it was actually second try, but the first try was also first try, so you just hit it two times in a row. <laughs> two in a row right off the gate, that was sick. Oh! You're okay? <laughs> that would be crazy. I feel like I could do that. Wow. It is insane. It is so insane. It's so sick, actually. Wow. Oh! <laughs> That's a chippy at all. <laughs> Are you gonna stop already, dude? You gotta keep going, dude. Thank you, Trey. Zero? Yeah. <laughs> he won't let me talk him into kickflip manual. I'm just gonna stick to the manual, Dan. <laughs> okay, we'll check you. Oh my God! It ain't every time, ever. Once again, first try guy. <laughs> I feel like Trey's the last trick you should try in this wind. I don't know if you can hear how loud the wind is right now, but it's really fast. Yes! First try again. Man, someone should put your name on the board. Is there, what other manual trick is there? I'm gonna give manual big flip a try. Manual big flip? That's what I was thinking was yeah. something big flip, because that's your kind of carry. Like manual big flip out? Yeah. <laughs> I kind of want you to knock the cone away. Simultaneously, as the wind ruined your kickflip, it knocked your coffee over. Win-win. <laughs> no pun intended. You're allowed to scrape. If that was a hip, you'd be rolling away. The most annoying thing about skating over cones is like every single time it gets hit or moved or whatever, it's like a different, slightly different spot. Because some people like cones closer, some people like cones further away. I prefer further because then you can always add more speed to get over it. When it's close, it's like hard to pop straight up early enough for certain picks. Oh. Wind. Yeah. You can only have cone sessions by yourself. When, when two people are skating a cone, it makes you think of like uh, Bugs Bunny and Daffy Duck, like it's rabbit season, duck season, like they keep like moving it back and forth slightly. Woo! <laughs> Literally almost first day. So we were here for a little bit the other day for uh, Caroline to do backside flip. She tried a couple, but she had to leave for work. So that's, that's a big goal for today. She's gonna get the backside flip. We take those! Try number three, best try yet. If you can't kick up low enough to consistently kick up manual that bad. <laughs> it's too little. Yes! 
Yes. Get off those curves, dude. It feels easier this way for some odd reason. He's an ambi skater. You only go one direction. I did not see that coming. <laughs> do something else. Uh -huh. Do another trick. I want to try to do that, but it's a thing. Oh, that's a good one. My buddy Derek has that one. Get us back. Okay. Well, you did that really easily. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Look at her go, dude. Every try. You don't learn tricks, do you? You just kind of do them. He's fallen on officially zero of those. <laughs> that one way didn't hurt. You see my heel just punch the I'm pretty sure that's called a kick, but yeah. <laughs> yes! So now he wants to do his half cap flip board back to taking a line. So do the manual, then backside flip, then half cap flip board. Yes! That's a sick line. <laughs> Caroline says she studied Devin's bicycle tip for the cone to help her with this one. You know what you want to? Fakey tray of the Euro right now. Yeah, you're right. Using the struggle today. Someone here today did a second try, but it wasn't Devin. <laughs> you're replacing Shane O'Neill with the industry league. I mean, Ellie Knox, I'm not sending her a clip. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna try to work some grooves into my truck, so I'm just gonna do a long 50 50. Watch how my trucks will like shuffle in the ledge and not actually pinch. It's really annoying. Yeah, on the long one. I'll start off though, I'll do like, yeah, I'll back, well, I'll back five of this ledge and then I'll nose manual to the thing and then we'll go good to the 50 50. Yeah, okay. We'll start like that. Okay, I like it, Dan. I already know I'm gonna miss the back five though. Got me hauling. Look at, I'm trying to be so steady. I'm trying to be so steady right now. Dude, this is all part of the line. This is this is all line. We planned this. Yeah, hundred percent. Yeah, he literally just showed up, jumped on my quarter pipe, and just looped out super hard because it's just so good in the wax. Like everyone knows, I'm not opposed to waxing things, but when you wax things to a dangerous degree, it's just like, dude, come on. 
especially like quarter pipes and stuff like that like if it's crazy sticky and not going you, you wax your trucks and then grind it or if you're real later wax your sole or whatever your grind pipes are like i understand that some tricks might not be possible but you landing a trick isn't worth other people getting hurt on you know Ledges, like, they're, we expect them to grind. We expect them to be slick, but not quarter pipes. Those should just be, have a little grip to them. And, like, if you are going to wax ledge, don't drown it. Like, you can wax it pretty good. But, like, especially when people, like, wax stuff up heavy for lip slides, like, you should feel friction on your lip slides. Your wheels should make a little bit of a noise. If you're doing a thousand foot long lip slide at a skate park, maybe don't. And this isn't even coming from like lip slide slander, just sometimes the world can do without certain tricks getting done for the safety of everyone else. You know what I mean? Just rolled in the bowl and did a 50-50. Almost looped out because he waxed the entire bowl too. Dude. Serious dickhead moves. Yes, that's it. Yeah. Now you got it. <laughs> you son of a bitch. Three more tries, then I'll let you walk away. She's got to do some street league work, uh, so she actually has to leave. Oh. <laughs> that was last try too. She said one more. <laughs>